a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Old Blenheim Bridge Old Blenheim Bridge was a wooden covered bridge that spanned Schoharie Creek in North Blenheim, New York, United States, with an open span of 210 feet. It had the longest span of any surviving single span covered bridge in the world, although the structure's total length made it second in that respect to the Bridgeport covered bridge. The bridge, opened in 1855, was also one of the oldest of its type in the United States. It was destroyed by flooding resulting from Tropical Storm Irene in 2011. Rebuilding of the bridge commenced in 2017 and was completed in 2018. History Nichols Montgomery Powers was brought in from Vermont to build the bridge by a group of local businessmen who formed the Blenheim Bridge Company for the purpose of constructing this bridge. The bridge opened in 1855 and remained in use for vehicles until 1932, when a steel truss bridge was constructed nearby. Since then, the bridge was maintained as a historic site open to pedestrians. It was declared a National Historic Landmark in 1964. On August 28, 2011, record flooding along the Schoharie Creek, due to Tropical Storm Irene, resulted in the bridge being washed away and completely destroyed. Longest Bridge Many sources simply claimed the old Blenheim Bridge was the longest surviving single-span covered bridge, without getting into span length versus total length. There are also sources that claim the Bridgeport covered bridge in California is longer. The New York Covered Bridge Society states that Blenheim Bridge was longer than a bridge in California, in terms of clear span. Blenheim's clear span was originally, according to this website, a report by the U.S. Department of the Interior states that the Bridgeport covered bridge has clear spans of 210 feet on one side and 208 feet on the other. While Blenheim Bridge had a documented clear span of 210 feet in the middle, in August 2003, measurements of post-repair Blenheim Bridge abutments were 209 feet on the upstream side and 205 feet on the downstream side. Historically, the longest single-span covered bridge on record was Pennsylvania's McCall's Ferry Bridge with a claimed clear span of 360 feet. Destruction The bridge was destroyed on August 28, 2011, as a result of flooding from Tropical Storm Irene. A witness saw its roof deposited onto a modern bridge just downstream, when the bridge was swept away at about 1 p.m. Over subsequent months, the Schoharie County Highway Department collected pieces of the bridge up to about 30 miles downstream. On July 21, 2015, National Historic Landmark designation for the bridge was withdrawn, and the property was delisted from the National Register of Historic Places. Replacement A replacement of the bridge is planned that will be 15 feet higher to avoid future floods. Plans are for the bridge to look and feel like it's the old bridge. Plans for replacement of the bridge took time and effort. Funding for reconstruction was at first opposed by FEMA, and the chair of a local committee characterized it as a battle to get approval. The construction is expected to cost $10.2 million, funded 75% by FEMA and 25% by New York State. It was started in early 2017. Preserved pieces of the original bridge may be used in some kind of memorial. The construction contract was advertised with bids due in October 2016 by the New York State's Governor's Office on Storm Recovery. PBS broadcast a TV show about the reconstruction in 2018. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries. Would you like to know more?